Everyone, welcome to COP1511 slash 1911, Fundamentals of Programming. Whether you're here from electrical engineering, computer science, software engineering, or you're taking this course as a free elective from some other random program at the university, we are welcoming you to uh, one of the largest courses at UNSW Programming Fundamentals. My name is Dr. Jake Renzella. I'm the lecturer in charge of the course this term. I'm joined by a team of admins who are going to introduce themselves from over here. Hi, I'm Grace. Hey, I'm Ivy. Hello, I'm Sophia. And I'm Andrew. And all we're going to do today is welcome you to the course, set you up with a few really important pieces of advice for week zero and week one, and then give you a little bit of uh, helpful tips and wisdom from our experiences as students and teachers of this, of this fabulous course. So what do we need to know to get started for week one and, and, and the rest of our week? Start by going to your tutorials. Yeah, so figure things. out your timetable. I think that's yeah. a good one. Know where you need to be. Uh, we really, really advise that you come to campus. Yes. Okay, coming to campus, coming to the lectures is the best way to meet people, understand where you're at and frame yourself within the course. Um, I know a lot of you have long commutes, but if you can set up your timetable in a way to get a good block of study out, yeah. it really, really helps. We see it time and time again. Anything else? Um, make sure you click all the links on the welcome announcement slash email. So that'll be the course website, the course forum. Make sure you can log into things and access yeah. everything yeah. you need um, to get started. We'll be sure to send you a really nice checklist of things that you need to make sure you're do, you, you do to get onboarded into the course. If you're not getting announcements or something like that, please reach out to us because you'll start getting a bunch of information from us really soon. All right, starting from over here, what's one piece of advice you wish you knew before you entered? University or Comp 1511? Um, I wish I, this is, I, I knew they existed, but I wish I went to help sessions earlier. I ended up going to, I think my, this is maybe not the best thing to say publicly, I think I went to my first help session uh, four days before assignment one was due, mm. and I had to queue up with about 90 other students because it was very, very busy. Everyone had started way before I did. Um, so my big thing is go to help sessions early so that you're following the concepts as you're going through the course. You might think to yourself, oh, I'll, I'll come back to that. I'll, like, I'll eventually get it. Just go ask the questions. We have heaps of tutors there to help explain stuff. So it's better to just make sure you're following as you go. Otherwise, it's, it's very easy to fall yeah, behind. Absolutely. Get on top of things early. Yeah, just piggybacking off that one. Just um, try to stay like, up to date with your content. Mm -hmm. Um, most things usually stack on top of each other, so you, things you learn from week one will be helpful in week two and so on. Um, so yeah, if you feel you're starting to lag behind, go to help sessions, ask uh, your tutors if uh, there's other ways you can get help. Mm. And forums. Mm. Yeah. Um, my thing would be to definitely focus on learning rather than the marks. Um, if you're applying yourself and actually learning, the marks will come, and as long as you're doing your best, that's really all that matters. Um, it's good to have goals and things if you know you want a specific mark in the course, uh, but just focus on learning and enjoying the course and meeting people in the course because um, that's how you're going to get the most out of it, not just grinding for a key. Bit of a cut. Andrew. <laughs> okay, if I could give you any advice, I would say ask for help if you need it. There's so much help available for you in this course. Go to the first lecture, go to your first tutorial, meet your tutor, if you need help with anything, ask your tutor, ask your lab assistant, uh, ask Jake after the lecture and post on the forum. Um, what, what you shouldn't do is get stuck and then keep falling behind um, because there's plenty of help available to you and if you just believe in yourself and seek the help, you can work through it. Yeah, you get out what you get in. And my advice would be to try and self-reflect. If things aren't going well, figure out what it is in your routine, your external pressures, your job. Maybe something's not set up in the right way to, to allow you the full success that you could, you're capable of. And try and change those things. Don't just go through the motions and finish the term and then you're really unhappy with what happened or you're really happy with what happened. But gradual improvements is the way we all improve. So regardless, that's all great advice. I hope you have a great time this, this term in Comp 1511. We're gonna get started straight away with uh, uh, programming content in the, in the first lecture, uh, just in, in a week. So I'm looking forward to seeing you all. Come to campus, say hi if you see us around campus, and um, we'll have a great term. Yeah.
Hello. Edit. Yeah, yeah, um, that's fine. Everyone's just gonna see us fall as I'm talking. Yeah, that'll yeah, yeah. blip us. Main video, right? There. Yeah. I was like, the video was so clear in the. Yeah, it helps. It helps. Yeah. <laughs> 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 <